I always feel that God puts you where he needs you. And there are people in this world that need me. And that is why I'm here. Lindsay is everything we're looking for in a caregiver. She's loving, she's compassionate, and she's a team player. She's always cheerful anytime I talk to her on the phone. She's always, sounds like she has a smile on her face. I love meeting people. I love having friends. I love making relationships. And that is what my work is about, is about going in there, figuring out what I can do to help them. And in return, I get so much from them. She was with um, Jim and Virginia for not quite two years, but she was our only caregiver and Lindsay was always there. Jim and Virginia are, they just have a special part of my heart. I worked with them for a long time, for almost two years. There was a lot of obstacles. We just found a way to make it work for them to live in their home, for them to be safe, you know? And so each and every day, we just, we, we had so much fun together. I met them, their kids, their family, and I still keep in touch with Jim. He was such a good client that I just still, to this day, I try to reciprocate that. I still care. No matter where you're at, wherever you go, we'll still be friends, and you can still call me. You can still, you know, chat and tell me what you want to tell me, and I'll still be there to listen. When uh, Virginia was given a short time to live, Lindsay, she just ran with it like it was her own parents or grandparents and was taking care of them. During one of the times she was getting ready to leave, and Jim said she didn't want her to leave, and, and she said, well, I'll be back, and because and, she was coming the next morning, and she said, well, I, I've lost two people this year, and I'm, I'm sad, and, and Lindsay looked at him befuddled and said, what do you mean? And she, he said, you only lost Virginia. She, you know, she passed away. She said, yeah, I lost my wife, Virginia, and I lost you as my caregiver. That was really cool to know that somebody does have a deep love and concern for her as a caregiver because she was with him so long and that they grew a bond that will never be replaced. When I found out that Jim was moving to California, it kind of, a piece of me left with him and it will always be with him. Willa Dean has Alzheimer's and her daughter was taking care of full-time and they needed full-time care and so Lindsay, it just was going to be work perfect with her schedule and so we put her on the daytimes. Willa Dean is a great person. She has dementia and with Willa Dean, we just go with the flow. Her dementia sometimes makes her scared or angry but usually I don't see those things with Willa Dean because I just keep calm in those situations and just reassure her of where she's at, what she's doing, and our days are pretty good. Kathy, the daughter, always says that Willa Dean never gets upset with Lindsay, and I think that's because of her personality, that she's always loving and compassionate and always looking out for the best interest that she needs at the time. I could just see the respect that uh, Willa Dean had for Lindsay, and that's how Lindsay is. She's just always trying to make sure that the client is taken care of and her needs are being met. I go to work and it's like I get to hang out with my friend. And in that time, I get to help them live the life in their own home that they would want to live. Everybody loves her. It's just one of those things that she's been with a client one time and they, they fall in love with her. It's just she, that personality, that love. She's real. She's not fake about it. Her real concern for them and her real love for them. You can see it. It's not just going to work and you never dread it because you get to have fun. You get to interact with somebody and you get to talk and you get to learn all about their life and they're letting you into a special part of their life. And you know, they're letting you into their home and you just become family, you just become one. And you look forward to seeing them each and every day and they look forward to seeing you each and every day. She just does everything right. She. Not that she doesn't do anything wrong, but, but she just does it right. She just does it with the love and compassion that that you and I want for our own parents, right? She she just does it right, and she does it with love and compassion, and, and does it by the book, I guess. I want to help people live in their home for the rest of their life, you know, as long as they can. I want to be that person that makes their life that much better.